Welcome to Well, That's, That's food. food. Today we have a drink. And it is corn silk tea. And it's made of corn silks. Like literally the little, um, I'm gonna put a picture on the screen, but the, you know when you shuck corn. Ingredients. Tea yes. extract of corn. Brown rice, yeah. cassia. So it should have a cinnamon it's flavor? Make, and, uh, yeah, I guess so. Corn silk, water solid. They also seem to say that it doesn't have any calories, which I'm a little concerned about, because I'm pretty sure it does. But Nam Young per pure corn silk tea manufacturing process is fastidious about raw materials to the complete productions to find good taste of well-dried corn silk in fine sunshine. Pure corn silk tea is made under Nam Young's high quality standards. Experience the benefits of nature ingredients. So question yeah. on this. At what point do you decide you're living in China, mm -hmm. where we make all of our tea, <laughs> and you're like, I am so desperate for a glass of tea, I'm gonna try to make well, actually, tea out of corn silk. South Korean. Okay, so if you're so desperate in South Korea, just go to China and get some tea. <laughs> uh, do they grow tea in? You have to you have to go through Best Korea to get there though, so that might not Ooh. be so bad. <laughs> Worst um, Korea. <laughs> best. There is a risk of product damage by shocking or freezing. Keep in cool place away from direct sunlight. Please keep refrigerate after opening and drink fast. There have deposits by ingredients. No deterioration of sludge is safe to lift and shake well. Well, I'm glad that that English made sense. <laughs> Allergy statement. It made on same manufacturing facility with peach tomato, silk soybean, wheat, peanut, and tree nuts walnut. Wait, they make silk on the same machine they make food on? And tomato. They make tomato. They make tomato. They make peach, tomato, milk, soybean, wheat. Oh, milk, not silk. They make, oh, milk, that's helpful. They, make, like, huh. they, make, they make the milk They're making cloth that. and tomatoes on the same yes. manufacturing equipment. And then I'm assuming that's an address, but I don't know. Yes, I don't. That is, it's an amount of things. Dear South Korea, how do you mail things to people? Because this address is so long. The level of effort required to ship things to places like this very high, and you're kind of in awe about how much advantage you take of um, the U.S. Postal Service. Anyway, that's weird and boring. So, corn silk tea. At some point, someone was desperate enough to be like, I'm gonna make tea out of this weird corn silk that comes in corn. All right. And, uh, sure. Why have we not gotten the silk out of corn yet? That's really the good question, but I guess because we need to make the tea. Right. How would we make pearls? <laughs> okay. Okay. Here we are. So corn, it's corn silk tea. tea, and we have a corn and a silk. <laughs> That's a beautiful drawing. right there. I love it. And uh, it's a sturdy bottle. This like, bottle, real sturdy. You know what I've said for the longest time on this show is that every other country in the has world real sturdy packaging. Oh wait, <sighs> did we check for sludge settle? <laughs> Close that back up real quick. Sludge is safe for settle, Justin. Nope, no sludge here. Okay, great. Excellent. Excellent. Looks, it's very yellow. Looks like German. I mean, it looks like a dark green tea, you know? Frankly. I mean, it's tea colored approximately. It looks like if you were dehydrated, you know? Yeah. Like real dehydrated. Oh, it smells. Why do we have so Does many it things smell on like a corn? show that smell? No. <laughs> I wish it smelled like a corn, you know? <laughs> Does it smell like exactly one corn? Can we take a moment and appreciate the fact that the bottle is like seven seven meters thick? Right, like, like that, look is, at, that is... Some it's, Does it smell like Sierra Leone? Uh, no. Nope, 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 nope. It smells like a burned sugar smack. You know when you leave laundry? No, no. no. Imagine a sugar smack. But burned? Okay, yeah. It smells sweet. And corny, and like caramel sugar. Man, you got you got a great smell, smelly smell. We're divided, so if you try this, let us know. Does it smell like no. ass, does or it does it smell like does it sugar smell like smacks? Mildewed laundry, or, or sugar smacks? Cereal. <laughs> that One of the two. A whole game show. Okay, but this smells more like, like when I smell that. this, it smells like damp clothes. Yeah, it smells well, like when you leave clothes in the washing machine to the point that you're like, dang, it you smells like those. Okay, so it's it's like I still get a sugar smacks smell at the end, the but it also smell. smells like your dog yeah. after the dog park when she decides she's queen of the mud. Yeah, that's that's exactly like right. a like, wet, like damp, dude. I'm still I'm a still moist, damp, 
dog. <laughs> I'm still going with the, I've opened the washing machine and I pulled clothes out and I realized that they've been sitting too long after I washed them. Like it's like a clothes. candle. If you put your nose really in it, it yeah. smells like damp laundry. If you get a whiff, yeah, that's it. it smells like sugar smacks. Hmm. Well, we'll see what it tastes like. All right, here we go. Cheers. It tastes like sugar smacks. Yeah, it kind of tastes like sugar it smacks. It tastes like watered sugar smacks. Like unsweet sugar smacks. But yeah, I don't, a little sweet. I actually don't hate that. Yeah. That's not bad. I thought it would be bad. No. Because it doesn't smell great. It doesn't smell great. But, well, I mean, you thought it kind of smelled good if you, like, get Right, if you don't put your, like, whole face in it. Yeah. No, no it's not bad, actually. It's not terrible. <laughs> Made of corn silk. Yeah, it just, like, it weirds my brain out because I want it to be crunchy. Because my brain says yeah, sugar smacks. It does have a cereal vibe. Like, it definitely tastes cereal like vibe. sweetened cereal. Yeah. Either puffed rice or puffed, like, corn. I don't know that I would seek this out over regular tea. Oh, you know what this really, really reminds me of? But Kicks. Kicks cereal. Okay. Yeah. The, they're basically I say like, sugar smacks because it has like a... Because, I mean, they're both puffed corn weenie. cereal. Yeah. But this sort of has like a caramel sugar flavor. Mm-hmm. Almost like the outside coating on a sugar smack that makes them sticky. Yeah, you know, yeah, That's yeah. why you have to have the yeah. weird foil bag thing. Right, right, exactly. That is good, though. Actually, it's not bad. It's weird, and um, I don't know It's really not my know favorite you thing I've it. done. But I don't hate I it. mean, when there's perfectly good tea. This is where I'm going back to. Who was desperate enough that's just like, I'm just, guys, I'm, I'm gonna boil this. Steep, I'm gonna steep all these corn soaks. There's a they dried it in corn the, farmer somewhere. They that, dried this in the sun first. So they like take the corn. Like after you've been like pulling corn off of the stalk, like shucking corn, and you're like, I'm gonna take these corn soaks and I'm gonna dry them in the sun. Then I'm gonna make tea out of it. I mean, I guess if you were really poor. Yeah, and you're like a subsistence farmer, but yeah. like the thing is I can afford actual tea, so I probably wouldn't, you know? Yeah, you know. I just want to know like how many other things did they try to make tea out of and they like did not turn out oh, so well? Oh, everything. Like every, just... Cat, I think humans... Cat, I think like, cat fur. Right, like I think like, humans boil <laughs> anything. Like I'm gonna boil any of this and try to make tea out of it. I mean, how do you think they made glue? The I'm gonna boil a horse's foot and see what happens. <laughs> Can't eat it. Sure is sticky though. <laughs> you know? Humans. Oh, great. This is to you, humans. When you made corn silk tea. Because we you could eat it show. and it wasn't sticky. Even with context, that's just. My cob was sticky with the silk? Oh. And on that note. <laughs> This show was brought to you by that noise. Thank you. Go. Corn silk tea. Sure, why not? <laughs> because what else are you going to do on a Thursday? Because when you've had other... Because <laughs> when you've had every other kind of tea, what's left? Corn Tension silk. tamer tea. Tension tamer tea. Celestial seasonings. Tension tamer tea. Yeah, so um, if you have any more comments about teas or you just think that we just didn't give enough homage to the corn soak tea majestics um or majestic if you just have some admit. tea you want to spell henties comments comment section below uh, keep stay tuned to this channel for videos and things shout out to vidme you guys follow us a lot and we appreciate that it's cool youtube was working on it but youtube's algorithms are a little bit sad and but I like make us not show up places. <laughs> it's hard for anybody to find us. But anyway, so uh, that's about it. It's hard for me to find me too. Sometimes it's hard for me to find myself. 